What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video. Now the other day I uploaded a video talking about Destiny as a whole and gave my opinion on whether or not the game's dead. Today I want to talk about simple changes made to the game which could and in my opinion would draw back many people who have moved on to newer games due to there being nothing left to do in Destiny. Not only that, but it would also give year two players more to do and an incentive to play these things. And these are the simple changes I have in mind. Weapons such as the Vex Mythal class and the Necrochasm, the Queen Breaker's Bow, the Dreg's Promise and the Lord of Wolves should be upgraded to a year two, meaning they would drop offering up to the current attack values that weapons drop from raids. Maybe add modifiers to the raids or something else so they ain't a walk in the park. Make the drop rates rare so not everybody in the world has the weapons within the first day. Like I've always said, exotics truly should be exotic. With simple changes like this, I'm certain it would warrant many people to go back and play these old year one activities. I mean, because at the moment they are completely pointless. If these old raids and the prison of elders had one thing to offer each, I'm absolutely certain everybody will go back to grind them. I mean, I understand weapons such as the fate ring at Bungie want people to move on from, but move on onto what? They don't want people using old year one weapons, they want people using new year two weapons and to mix it up, which I understand. And what they did when they released the Taken King by making all year one gear useless at the time was the right call, but I think now it's time for that to change. Most of us have felt and used the change, so why ain't we got the option to change back? I think we should be able to. Also the Taken King in my opinion was smart in the sense new players could start from year 2 and wouldn't be affected by year 1 loot. But to be honest that don't have to change. Players can still start with the Taken King but have the option to go back if they want to. I'm not saying bring back these old raids with better loot than what we get in year 2 stuff. I'm just saying equally out so we have the option to go back and play them if we want to. I think us players who have played from the start should have that option to go back and a reason to grind for and implementing these changes would be minimal and would warrant many people to come back play and grind destiny i don't know about you guys but i miss playing them old raids and sure if bungie don't want us using old weapons they should give us new weapons which are on the same level and to be honest remember these old weapons would be new weapons to year two players it would be a great new feature one maybe bungie have thought about already and are hopefully considering I also think Bungie can't go into new DLCs thinking of new players, I mean yeah for sure consider them, but consider us older players who have spent a lot more on and in the game than anybody else. I understand trying to bring in more new players is a top priority, but at the end of the day it shouldn't be the main priority. But guys what do you think about this, do you think implementing these simple changes to old raids would warrant a lot of people who have left the game because nothing else to do to come back and grind. Let me know what you think about this matter down below in that comment section. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Do drop a like. I do appreciate the support. Subscribe for Daily Destiny and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out until next time. Peace. We all on YouTube every damn day. Watching these vids of the brand new games. Bid after bid, many are the same. That's why you gotta go and find DPJ. Destiny gameplays, weekly snipes. Heavy uploads gonna have you a hype. Started in the UK, now he's worldwide. DPJ, go and subscribe.